hi guys welcome back to the channel welcome to another savings challenge video if you're new here welcome thank you for clicking on this video if you love cash and love stuffing savings challenges and budget videos then consider subscribing and join this family if you are returning thank you so much for coming back so today i'm going to be stuffing my long my short term savings challenges which is mostly the ch saving challenges that i got from other shop owners like and there are small small challenges that i'm going to be finishing within a month or two most of these i'm finishing in a month i hope to finish them in april but one of them i may not finish in april so which is fine so yes i'm going to count this money out real quick i have 250 dollars here to stuff into these savings challenges so now i have 20 40 60 81 20 40 60 82 20 30 to 35 to 40 45 to 46 47 48 49 50 51 sorry i have 251 dollars not 250 251 is what i have to stuff how is everybody doing today i hope you all are doing good i am back recording in case you notice anything i mean <laughs> I'm recording three videos today all for next week because I'm not going to have time to record every day to upload three times next week. So here we are. I have the money available so why can't I just stuff it and record it one time. So I'm going to be starting with this one that I got from Liz of Liz and Les. This one she gave it out as a freebie on her community page. So I just cut, I printed the small version of it and cut it out so it can fit in my envelope. And since I'll, I am not doing it daily, so I'm just going to do it by the week or however, how much I have. So I'm going to be stuffing $18 into this. So 2 plus 3 plus 4 plus 5. Uh, no, not $18. I have $28 here. So... I have to get my, grab my calculator real quick because I forgot what numbers I was going to stop today. Okay, guys, I got it figured out. So I'm going to be doing all of this all the way to here. And then to make $28, I will do this one. So I'm crossing out number two and then $3, $4, $5, $1, $2, $3, $4, and another $4 down here to make $28 total. So I have 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 110, 120, 130, 140, 150, 160, 170, 180, 190, 190, 190, 190, 190, 190, 190, 190, 190, 190, 190, 190, 190, so I have 20, 40, 50, 55, 60, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70 dollars so far. So we only have 20 more dollars and we're done. 20 more dollars and we will be done. Next one is also from Lee's. I purchased this one from her Etsy shop. And I'm still not sure if I'm doing this right. But guys, uh, the main thing is I'm saving money. I'm not sure if I'm putting the stickers down the right way, but we're saving money, okay? So that's what matters. So today I'm going to put $40 in, so I'm going to be laying down four stickers. Each of these stickers equals Okay, so yeah, so forty dollars is gonna be going into this challenge, and then we're gonna count all together. I do not like doing it's it's even challenge for a very long time, so that's why I like to do small ones so I can finish them on time. So now twenty, forty, sixty, eighty, one, one o five, and one ten. This challenge is supposed to be 
I almost forgot that I paused this video. I had to, oh, I was cooking something. My daughter came and got me to check the air fryer. Okay, so this savings challenge is supposed to save me $150 when I'm finished, right? 150 So, uh, I have 20, 40, 60, 81. One hundred and ten dollars so far. So forty more dollars we will be done. Next up is gonna be the sloth savings challenge, and I am putting a big chunk of money into this challenge today just because I want to finish it by the end of April. So this is the way I run my savings challenges. If I have the money because I budget for my savings challenges right at the beginning of the month. So I already have, I already know how much I'm going to have at the least for my savings challenges for the month. So I just break them up into like three or four videos. So in order for me to finish this challenge in April, I have to put $60 in today. So I know I scratched a few on camera. No, I think I did all of this on camera. Or maybe not. I don't know. Sometimes I come in here and scratch more after I record. So I do have $60 scratched, which is 20 40 50 and 60 Yes, 60 So 20 40 50 60 That's what I am stuffing today. And the savings challenge envelope is going to be this one. I have two challenges in this envelope as well because I am doing two challenges from Janelle. That's why I have them in the same envelope. So 20, 40, 60. It's going to be added to today's challenge. And now I have 20, 40, 60, 81, 20. In the sloth savings challenge by Janelle Ray Budgets. I will link all the shop owners in the description. And with the one that is mine, I will also link link my shop in the description so now i have only four left to stuff in this last challenge and now like i always do i'm gonna go ahead and scratch just to give me an idea how much i need to have for my next video i love the scratch ups but guys i like to scratch my own ahead of time just so i'm not Cut on our wears. I do not like to have IOUs at all. So, yes, this is why I do this. So, now, next time when I come in here, I'm going to put 10, 30, 35, 40 dollars, and I'm going to be finished with this challenge. And the next one that I have in this envelope is also from Janelle, and I'm going to go ahead and do it now. And it is another scratch up that I got from her, and it's the spring, the yellow spring scratch up challenge. And they are the tiny, tiny ones, then the tiny scratch ups. So, and I, I scratched thirty nine dollars in total. So I'm gonna go ahead and check them off right now. Okay, so $39 is what I scratched off for this challenge, and I'm going to go ahead and put that in here. 20 30 Oh, okay, I think it was $39, but I didn't have change, so I decided to put $40 in there. Yes, because I did not have enough change, so I'm going to be putting $40 into this challenge today. And now, so far, I have 20, 40, 60, 70, 75, 80, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89 dollars so far. And this is the only challenge that I feel like I may not be able to finish in April, which is fine. I'm not in a rush to finish it, so I'm definitely going to finish this in May if I don't finish it in April. Maybe by the beginning of May, I should finish it. So I'm going to go ahead and scratch, like, maybe four dots so i have 25 in total scratched for next time 
$25. I, I don't know if I mentioned that. <laughs> yeah, $25 for next time. Next up is this one that I got as a freebie from Marlene of Snow Gardener 307 Budgets. And I'm going to be finishing this challenge today. I scratched a total of $25 and I'm going to be rounding this up today. I'm so excited. So I have 5 plus 12, that's 17. 17 plus 9 is 20. Okay. No. 12 plus... Eight. That's 20 plus 5, 25. Yes, 25 dollars goes into this challenge and we are done. This was a freebie. She sent this to me in a card. But oh, I think it was in this, the St. Patrick's Day card that she sent to me. So now I have 20, 40, 60, 65, 70 dollars in total saved up in this challenge. And I don't have a blank for it yet. So, I don't know. I'm going to have to sleep over it and think deeply. <laughs> so, this is officially completed. Next up is going to be the Hop Into Savings Challenge. The one I created and this is available in my shop. It's only $1, guys. And you get a freebie when you purchase this. This is the freebie you're going to get, the meal planner. And it's only a dollar. So, hurry up over to Fort the Crib com and grab your own copy so I'm going to be putting $30 into this challenge today each bunny equal $10 the carrot is five so I'm going to do two bunnies and two carrots there you go so $30 is going to go into this challenge I know Easter is over, but this is just for fun. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with this money yet as well. Most of the challenges in this binder right now, I don't have a plan yet for them, but I'm going to definitely find something to do with them. So now I have 20, 40, 60, 70. This is a very, very low income savings challenge, and the total amount saved after, after everything is going to be $84. So we're going to be going to... The last one that I have today, and this is the one that I got from Kim of Star Budgets. Uh, yes. And today I'm going to be putting $28 into this challenge. Let me go ahead and check them off. So I can tell myself that I have already stuffed those numbers. I think that's it. This one. So $28 is what we're going to put in here today. So 20, 25, 26, 27, 28. And the goal amount in this challenge is $110. It's also another low income savings challenge. So now I have 20, 40, 60, 70, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, $80. Which tells me I just need 30 more dollars. Yes, 30 more dollars to finish this challenge. So guys, thank you so much for watching and I will catch you in my next video. Bye-bye.